Hey everyone, I hope your 4th of July was amazing. Today we're going to be talking about plant stands. So I'm always in like big need of plant stands because I have all these plants and they're just sitting on window seals and everywhere all around the house. I'll be showing you how to make a cute little modern plant stand for just a couple of bucks and also this DIY will include a DIY faux marble effect which I did with a feather and some acrylic paints. It's pretty easy. You guys won't believe how easy this is to do. I thought it'd be a lot harder. But, um, okay then, let's jump right in. For the dimensions and full list of supplies, visit the link in the description. You'll need some wooden dowels, a square piece of wood, and some Gorilla wood glue. You'll also need some white spray paint, clear coat, a broad nailer, a feather, acrylic pants, paints, and a sponge. To begin, you'll start by gluing your dowels together. I glued my dowels to create a rectangle. I let the glue dry a bit before using my broad nailer to secure it. Since I was creating a box, I made two rectangle frames exactly the same. Then I connected my rectangles to the other dowels creating a box. I don't own any clamps so I had to use random props to help me do this but when I was almost done my awesome hubby jumped in to help. It definitely helps if you have an extra set of hands helping you doing these steps. Okay, instead of staining my plant stand I decided to paint it black since I figured the marble look would look better with black instead of staining the wood. I just used some regular flat black spray paint, following that to prep my faux marble top I painted my square piece of wood with some white flat paint and let it dry before doing anything else to it. To make my faux marble effect I used some grey acrylic paint and diluted it with water. Then I dipped a feather into it and dragged messy lines across the surface. I made sure they were all kind of leaning towards one direction. It helps if you have an example to look at, you can try google images. Following that, to blur out the lines, I used a sponge, I applied some white paint with a tiny bit of water and smudged it onto the lines, making sure it looked blended. Then to complete the look, I used a tiny bit of very diluted black paint and used a super fine paintbrush to bring out the darkest parts of the lines, just a tiny bit here and there. I also blended this with the moist sponge, making sure not to completely wipe it away. Make sure you do this one spot at a time, it dries super quick. Then I clear coated my top and secured it to the plant stand and that's it! Okay, there's one thing I regret that I didn't do. For the top of my little plant stand. I did not use a solid piece of wood. I used some sort of plywood and it has like texture that you can see on the sides. I wish I would have used a solid piece of wood because the surface would have been a lot more cleaner and it would have looked a lot more like marble. So as far as the edges go, it kind of throws me off. But if you stand far enough, it looks like marble. Um, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this DIY. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. If you aren't subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. I try and post DIYs every week. Okay then everyone, I'll see you guys next time.